And a Juventus personnel change here. Ollie Watkins. They weren't going to get past Bonucci. Deflected behind. Corner forthcoming. Let's see about the delivery. And a simple clearance, a good one. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Could play it in. Thirty minutes left for play. In with a chance. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Well, Spurs have been trying for a while to get this deal over the line, and now it is over the line, Stuart. Yeah, at that price, I think he's value for money. He'll certainly improve their squad and maybe the team. It's a good signing, you have to say. Juventus keep possession, and it's positive possession. What can they do from this position? Oh, he's through here. And there it is, the opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, here it is again, and just look how he turns away from his marker and then gets his shot away. That's a very good goal, you have to say. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Moussa Diaby, Watkins, getting forward. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Ollie Watkins. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Can he convert? It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. And it's a quality pass. Oh, couldn't beat the goalkeeper. And really should have been able to. Douglas Luiz. Pau Torres. A very good tackle. Locatelli. Oh, that's a fine looking pass. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defense. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Matty Cash. Well, they have the ball once more. Ollie Watkins. And well, they've given him too much space. And a fine reading of the situation. And taken cleanly by the goalkeeper. Not great distribution from the keeper. This could be the equaliser. But no, he's fluffed his lines. Good heavens. Well, that's the chance they've been looking for. The question is, will they get another one? Time is running out now. Arkadiusz Milic. Could be dangerous. Can they open things up? Well, will that come back to haunt them? A golden chance miss. Well, the game should be over. How's he missed that? So, making the substitution now.
There might very well be late excitement. Five minutes left, and the margin just one. Trailing as they are, they're not likely to get too many opportunities late in this game. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. That's a good pass. Locatelli. Vraovic. On to Rabio. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Cash. So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team and they deserve their victory. through here and there it is the opening goal 1-0 and they'll feel they deserve it can they open things up well, will that come back to haunt them a golden chance miss well the game should be over how's he missed that Hi there, great to have you with us. It's a beautiful sunny day. I'm delighted to be able to report here at the Estadio Presidente Perón. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And we have more live action from the pre-season second group stage. It's Sevilla and they take on Juventus. Well, Derek, after that first game, I'm sure we'll see a lot of squad rotation. And the coach will have had a chance to review their performance. Pre-season or not, there's still three points to win. And a good win here will set the tone for the season. Really good challenge. So we can check on the starting lineup. Well, it's a back four, a narrow midfield three, and a very disconnected front three. But if the midfield players give good support to the central striker, this 4-3-3 system could work really well today. And this is how Juventus will line up. Wojciech Szczesny begins in goal. And... Oh, in for the chance! Can he finish? Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Another play for a Juventus throw-in. A chance to whip it in. Well, in Yusuf and Naziri, they have the sort of player who can trouble any defence. He'll be hoping to do that in this game. What might we see from him? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Arkadiusz Milik. That's how to dispossess your opponent.
in Naziri. Well, it's a good looking position. Is there a goal in the future? Oh, fancy footwork. Dangerous ball. Threat over for now, it seems. Moise Keane. Now, who can he play it to? Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. And Nesiri. Space galore for Juventus. Can he put them in front? Well, it was a wonderful chance, but the goalkeeper comes through. Yes, Derek, we have to give credit to the keeper, but surely he should have scored there. That's a big, big chance. Sevilla struggling to keep the ball. And Nesiri. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Torres. Good work from Sevilla to win it back. Giving it a real go in the wide area. And Nesiri. Very quick thinking there. He has teammates around him. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Rovella. Potentially a chance to do damage on the flank. For Juve. Oh, chance missed. Nil-nil it remains. Well, chances don't come much better than that. What a miss that is. So, chance to run at them. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Using the wide route could be beneficial for Juve. Has a go. And the keeper more than equal to it. Has to clear his lines. Clean challenge. Milik. He could pick out a teammate. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. Fine work from Juve to win back possession. Keane. in strongly to win the ball now he must favour the cross Moise Keane well they keep passing away surely a oh, good hit Close shave. Good high press.
And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. And so the battle commences. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Well, nothing for them to worry about in the end. Good defending. Torres. Yusuf and Nesiri. And with that, the attack fizzles out. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Juventus. But he's decided that no advantage was forthcoming, really. And so it's a free kick. And now, Arkadiusz Milik. Well, no let up, plenty of pressure. And an astute piece of defending. Well, plenty of interest in Wolves and what they've been doing on the transfer front. Good news for their fans. Stuart, new signing in place. Well, he's certainly got ability. A lot of clubs have been in for him, but now he needs to fulfil that potential. He might just have to be patient, though. Making progress. He might be able to carve something out. And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. So making the substitution now. Danilo. And teammates around him. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Superbly read and executed. Needs to tread carefully. So. Juventus, the old lady, they know how to keep the ball. What can they do from here? Oh, surely! Well, hit with ferocity when accuracy was required. Thirty minutes left for play. And the ball back with Juve now. Oh, that's a really good run. Being pressed hard. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. And time for the change now. Understandably, he wanted to give it a go, but straight at the keeper. And Nesiri. And the challenge halts them in their track. The object of the exercise from Juventus is to get it forward. That's what they're doing. Ball lost by Juventus. Corona. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Nicely blocked. It's a substitution for Juventus. It's a short one. Electing to cross into the center. What an important piece of defending. And Juventus have been dispossessed. Excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward. Always going to be the goalkeeper's ball. 
Zakaria. It's with Milik. Good tackle. Going well. Well, unfortunately, he couldn't keep the shot down. And a substitution in the offing. Hi there, great to have you with us. It's a beautiful sunny day. I'm delighted to be able to report here at the Estadio Presidente Perón. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for analysis by Stuart Robson. And we have more live action from the pre-season third group stage for you to look forward to. It's Juventus and they take on Athletic Bilbao. Well, both these teams will be looking for a strong finish to the group stages here today in what has been a really good tournament so far. Certainly the quality of the football has been excellent. Just hope that's the case again today. And now they get the ball rolling. And the old lady of Italian football going with this starting eleven. Wojciech Szczesny stands between the posts. Danilo starts alongside Leonardo Bonucci in central defence. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Oh, good-looking run. But no damage done. That's the main thing. Well, let's run the rule over the Athletic Bilbao starting lineup. De Marcos plays with Yuri Bercice in the fullback positions. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one. Oh, might be. Oh, magnificent save! Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. They must clear their lines quickly. Alex Berenguer. Sunset. Well, spot on with that challenge. It is advantage Juve. Moise Keane. 
and fed forwards but he drifted into an offside position well he just thought about the pass for a fraction too long and that's why it's offside sunset can they trouble the opposition this time a disappointing end to the move and just narrowly wide in the end. Rabio. Vlahovic. He might be able to profit from the wide position. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. And the emphasis is on creativity. Oh, the threat is there. A foul, but no whistle. Instead, advantage Juventus to give them the advantage oh the referee points to the spot penalty and into the book he goes too well once he gave the penalty he was always going to give him a yellow card this to open the scoring here oh no it's all well, he's just got to forget that. That's a shocking penalty. Vesca. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. But quick thinking defensively. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Can they forge ahead? They do! And you've got to say, they're good value for the lead. Well, as you can see, this was always coming. They've been piling on the pressure. It's a well-deserved goal. So the match has restarted. 1-0 here. Sunset. Guru Seta. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And the flag was up in good time. It's offside. Well, he should have realised that was going to be offside. That's a poor decision to play that pass. Well, couldn't quite find his teammate. The referee has let the advantage accrue to Juventus. And he's through here. Oh, but denied. Full credit to the keeper. Well, of course he should score, but what a save that is. Not quite what they were working on in training this week. Danilo. Well, he keeps going. Genuine chance. Well, the keeper in position to prevent another goal from him. Well, he's a massive threat. That really could have been his second goal there. Well read to put an end to that attack. Feeding it through. Can he take the chance? And another goal for the Bianconeri. Big moment for Juventus in this game. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one foot in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Under Herrera. On to Berenguer. Herrera. Oh, that's 
So to dispossess your opponent. What can he do with it now? This looks promising. Is this the moment? And he's made it a brace for himself. The defender is just unable to stay with him. And he's having a field day. Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. Blistering first half display. And just look at that score. Nicolo Rovella. Promising looking ball. And Juve unable to keep the ball. Did really well to get through. And inches away. Didn't miss by very much at all. Well, as you can see, Juventus have been really good going forward. They've created so many chances, and if they score again soon, it could become very embarrassing. Plenty of support here. Oh, great block. Not a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. Totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Locatelli. The tackle completely mistimed, and you would expect a booking under the circumstances. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. Oh, might be. Oh, magnificent save. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. And he's got the beating of his opponent. Oh, good vision. Oh, so close to opening up the defence. He's gone for goal. Well, it ended up being easier for the goalkeeper in the end. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And I think we had a feeling this transfer was going to go through. Thomas Lamar has completed his move to West Ham, Stewart. Well, at £30 million or thereabouts, he represents good value for money. He's got a lot of skill, and I think he'll add quality to their squad. There's no doubt about that. Sloppy in possession from Juventus. Good-looking sequence, but a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Dusan Vlahovic. Nicely timed tackle. And threading it through. The fans are shouting, shoot! Well, very disappointing. And I wonder if it adds a bit of pressure when you sense everyone wants you to have a go. Well, I think he was right to shoot, but his technique let him down there. Good 
technique displayed. And let's give credit to the defending. A real opening now. Penalty in the opinion of the referee. And this is seriously getting away from them. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here. Is it going to be 4-0? Oh, he's fired it wide. Well, it's the ultimate sin. He's got to hit the target. Muniain. Marco Arnautovic with it. Chances on. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. It's Jensny. It has to be. Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. Locatelli. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. A fine reading of the situation. <laughs> Athletic club regaining possession. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Well, good run, this. Now, what can he do with it? Very quick thinking there. Williams. Arnautovic. Pretty routine there for the goalkeeper. Bremer. Just 15 minutes remaining. Shown inside. And still looking for space. But the danger averted for now. Herrera. Now sliding in field. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. So making the substitution now. Under pressure to get it away. Locatelli. And now Rabio. And fine goalkeeping. Playing it in, and it still could be dangerous. Failure to keep the ball by the Bianconeri. Arnautovic. Oh, he's given us away. Risky play. Oh, could be. Excellent block. Danilo. 
tackle taken away. De Marcos. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Yuri Bertice. Sunset. He read the situation defensively and did his job. The referee blows for full time. It ends at a victory for the home team. No complaints from the fans here. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent. Full of it. A new beginning, the opening match day of the season and a keen sense of optimism enveloping everyone. Who will come out on top? We have all the action for you live on... And a warm welcome on what is an ideal night for football, you've got to say. My name is Derek Ray and my commentary partner on this occasion is Stuart Robson. And there are few more enjoyable days on the football calendar than opening day in Serie A. It's Udinese and they take on Juventus. Well, thanks, Derek. It might be the first game of the season, but these away fans are already talking about winning the title. So it's important they get off to a good start here. This should be an entertaining game. Well timed tackle. The line up then for the hosts. Well, 3 5 2 is a good system only if you have top class wing backs because they have such a key role. They have to cover the whole length of the field, both with and without the ball. And space available inside. Crossing possibilities. Oh, good looking run. And it might be. Well, it goes down as a miss so early in this game. Well, it may be early in the game, but that should have been a goal. No doubt about that. That's a big chance. Well, the nerves are perhaps jangling a bit more than usual because it's his debut for the club here. Well, it's certainly given them some quality in those wide areas. He's a good runner with the ball, he can deliver good crosses and he has a real change of pace. So I'm looking forward to his performance today. 
And the old lady of Italian football going with this starting 11. Well, it's the same shape, but they do play it slightly differently. They switch play as often as possible and will also get their outside centre-halves to break into midfield. On paper, it looks a good team to me. Saraga. Effective challenge. And slipped through beautifully. Now he must favour the cross. Well, he loves drifting in off the flank. Surely! Every goalkeeper would expect to catch that one. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Wallace. Well, Juventus have it back here. Now, what can they do from here? Now, options are plenty. And they might forge ahead. There is the goal to open the scoring. Who can say they don't deserve to be in front? Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. So the ball rolling again with the score line standing at 1 0. Trying to open up the defense. Vlaovic. The game has been turned on its head. They have never stopped believing, and now they sense victory. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. He continues his run. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Who can he pick out? And making sure there was no danger in the end. That's a good looking ball. Now he's got to stay calm. A majestic piece of goalkeeping there. That's goalkeeping at its best. He's so hard to beat from that sort of range. Now, how about the short corner? And played in. Could still be dangerous. He'll have a go here. Oh, a good diving save. Oh, and off the bar. Toba. Saraga. And snuffed out the danger immediately. Wallace a very good tackle and space to exploit maybe and he's in and that was goalkeeping right out of the top drawer it's absolutely remarkable his reflexes were brilliant there Sloppy in possession. Well, standing off them here, aren't they being too passive? Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Theme emerging of wasted possession. 
Oh, that's a really good run. And just over the bar. Excellent effort it was. Biol. And pressing from the front. Not looking all that comfortable on the ball. Barella. Wallace. Beto. Well, there's a really stylish piece of running. Can he convert? That was going in. Well, these fans can sense an opportunity here. They need to make the most of this corner. And over it comes. And that's very confident goalkeeping in not easy circumstances. An effective challenge. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. And the shot. And a decent save. Full credit. Playing it in and clearing his lines. So the whistle then. We're up the halfway stage in this match. And now they get the ball. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Barella Dusan Vlahovic he could pick out a teammate has a go and just narrowly wide in the end well those stats tell you everything Juventus have been excellent and unless something changes this could get embarrassing Wallace. Well, I should think Arsenal fans are in a pretty good mood following this news. The contract situation ironed out, and he might be in action pretty soon, Stuart. Well, certainly a lot of focus on the boy over the last year or two, and he seems to have a bright future ahead of him. Opportunity! And a goal this time! Applying the finishing touch, just what the doctor ordered. Here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease, and it's just a change of pace. And then the shot could not be hit any better. Struck with such reading. Great goal. Perfect tackle. Vlahovic. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Vlaovic. Could be threatening. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Locatelli. And it should be a Serie A game to savour. You can see it live with us here on EA TV. It's Udinese taking on Salernitana. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium. And two very good teams. Now 
And he cuts in from the wing. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Wallace. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. And fine goalkeeping. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And over comes the corner. Not quite what they were working on in training this week. Lazar Zamajic. Good work to regain possession. Now we have a plethora of live matches coming up for you here on EA. Oh, what a great chance this is, Derek. That's a routine take. Twenty minutes remaining now. And cutting inside. Well, really rifling that one in, and he didn't miss by much. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up, and now both will rely on their respective benches. Getting in there to intercept. Moise Keane. Well, he's certainly not alone. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Must be! And the opportunity goes a-begging. He decided to hit that with power rather than going for placement. Now in a more than decent position. Moyes Keane. Oh, he's through here. He can't hold on to it. And in at the second time of asking, but the goalkeeper... Well, as you can see, it's an error from the goalkeeper. You just can't spill it into a dangerous area like that. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Brenner. Determined defending. Now, can they hit them on the counter? And he's broken free! Well, it might still work out for them. And putting pay to the danger. Moise Keane, in position! Oh, good work by the keeper. Zamaji. Lovric. Juve struggling to keep possession here. Well, they know they need to stop him. And intercepts again. Very effective pass. And there it is. A goal. 
But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, not too much defending going on in the grand scheme of things. 4-1. Kostic. Vlahovic. Running with the ball confidently. And Juventus will get the throw in. Well, found wanting in the throw in department there. Well, taking into account all the stoppages, two minutes to be added on. And a free kick awarded by the referee. In the right place to cut out the pass. Arkadiusz Milik. And can they exploit the space out wide? This looks more than decent. And so the final whistle here. The visitors come out on top. Stuart. Yeah, they should be happy with that. It was a good display and it's always important.